One, two, one, two, three, four, five, six.
Hey everyone, I'm Cole Novak. I'm Michael Phelps. We recorded and played the guitars for I Need You, and we're here to talk you through what's going on. So uh, to start, Phelps, yeah. what kind of tones are you working with on this song? Uh, this one is a fun one for me. I have a little bit of delay and verb and a compressor on this time. Uh, but I add a reverse delay for the intro and hey first verse, which gives it kind of this ethereal kind of just And that sets up when the first bridge or chorus starts, excuse me, I, if I flip it to normal. But it's literally just a rolling part over and over. And then so in the cool. second verse, I have a, a lead line that I play really simple, just a little bit of drive. Just... And I just repeat that twice. And then on to big old power chords. Big old power chords, everybody's favorite. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, I've got um, pretty similar kind of like picking stuff going on in this song. My guitar is tuned down a whole step every string. It's in D standard, uh, which this song is in the key of D. So that's actually really helpful because you've got these big E mm -hmm. shapes throughout the entire song. So I'm utilizing these open strings at the bottom uh, a lot on this song. So the intro part is just a really simple kind of uh, looping picking like this. And that's all that I'm doing on the verses. Uh, on the first chorus and the second chorus, I'm playing a picking part as well that is matching with the melody uh, of the vocal, like this. So you've got those open strings providing a little bit of a different rhythm against the matching with the vocal, which is kind of nice. Um, second verse, I play that same part. And then, um, once we hit the bridge, I jump up to what essentially feels kind of like a keys part, um, where it's just arpeggiating down through the scale and then matches with the vocal on the back half. And that's it on the bridge, and just kind of builds up through there. Then when we hit the big chorus with the hits, it's just big rocking out chords. Um, and my part there on the last chorus changes from matching the melody to a harmony with the melody. So that sounds like this. And then for the last section, when we jump back up to the bridge, I jump back to my same part, but I'm on the bridge position now. So it's cutting a little bit more. And then I add a boost on the back half where it turns into an instrumental. Um, and the melody changes just slightly on the back half just to add a little bit of interest. So that's what this sounds like. And that's it. That's I Need You. I hope this has been helpful for you guys. Have fun.